title game. Wow, everything's turned around for Brian Voss. His opponent, Dennis Jakes, had the unlucky fate of leaving a solid eight and a solid nine to open the door for Voss to get into this championship game. Now, Voss, nothing going right through six frames, trails by 13. Now he'll move over to the lane. It's been bothering him. Due to severe weather conditions, tomorrow's Motorcraft 500 has been canceled, but we will be on the air at 1 Eastern, 12 noon Central Pacific with a look back at last year's race. Then, at 5 Eastern, the world's top drivers compete in the identically prepared cars in the first challenge of the International Race of Champions. All tomorrow, ABC Sports. A four. Left lane just hooking more and more as we get farther through this championship round. Voss went with a little extra loft, a little extra speed, and didn't quite get the right adjustment he needs. He'll be nailing this, this lane here in the ninth frame, but we'll see how much he either leads or trails by because George Branham has a good chance to jump out to a 24-pin lead here. Okay. We're in Baltimore, which has one of a kind museum called Great Blacks and Wax. People I've known, Joe Lewis, Jesse Owens, Jackie Robertson, Mary McLeod Bethune, Booker T. Washington, those I didn't. What great men in history, George Washington. We're in Baltimore, and believe me, it is bad outside. Here's our tournament leader, ready to go. Big shot, he has not struck on this lane in the match. Gives it the long, hard look. There, take that one. George Branham has never won from the, the lead position, the number one spot, and right now he has it all going for him. He has not missed striking on the left-hand lane. He's got one of the great champions, 24 pins in arrears, and can drive him down to a 34-pin deficit with just two frames remaining, if he can strike. That's it. Top seeds this year. Six victories, six and three. Good spot. It is a good spot as Boss is just reaching down for his reserves. He knows he has a potential 216. George Branham going at a 209 pace with this conversion. Two frames left for the championship. Two great champions. Brian Boss now up had his first victory, 235 to 214 over Bob Spaulding. Then defeated Dennis Jakes, 266 to 217. I want to see a, a man keep his composure under pressure. As you look at the grip of Boss, the full fingertip grip, watch Boss under pressure. He maintains that form, and he needs strikes right now. Definitive. Reading his lips, he said, this is the lane and this is the shot. Without a strike here, I don't believe Brian Boss has any chance of defeating George Branham III. This is the match, ninth frame. George not watching. That's why he's won 12 big championships. Player of the year in 88. You betcha. Watch this. It's Saturday afternoon, and Brian Voss throws his Sunday ball right here. He puts it on Branham. Today, George was bowling for his neighbor, John Adams, who's hospitalized in the Oaks Gets back home. 
George lets this ball slide off his thumb, getting by the head pin, just a piece of it. Leaves the 2-5-8. With a spare, he would lead by 10 pins going into the 10th frame. If he misses, he would fall behind by one. Big shot there. Mm -hmm. We have a situation right now where the players, if they both strike out in the 10th, we would be tied. Boss, potential 216. Branham, potential 216. However, advantage Branham because he has the lead of 10 pins, but he has the spare working. Hanging tough. He knows how to win. He won his first championship in Chicago by throwing a double in the 10th frame against the great Mark Roth. Right now, it would behoove him to throw another double here in the 10th to put some pressure on, pressure on Boss. He cannot shut out Boss, however. Second in the 1991 Masters. <laughs> Goodness. You can see it in his eyes. Look at his little quelled up around the face. He knows he has championship in hand, at least a tie, if he can strike. You got to count everyone because the man is on the bench. What intensity. George Brenham the third. Branham's finest performance, will it be enough to win? Boss must strike on the next three balls to tie and send it into a two-frame roll-off. Must strike every ball. a big winner's smile and a handshake and a hug. Great victory for Branham, his third in a relatively long career. ABC Sports will be back.